Maryland's law against using a handheld phone while driving went into effect in 2013. But according to a state lawmaker, the problem has only gotten worse. And WJZ's live political reporter Pat Warren says there is a proposal to raise the fine substantially. Pat? That's right, Denise. This Howard County delegate wants to hit drivers where it hurts in the wallet as a deterrent to them possibly hurting someone else with their car while talking on the phone and driving. Harford County resident Russell Hurd's daughter was killed by a texting driver. She was traveling with her fiance to meet her mom and I at the, the wedding planner. Susan Young's son Jake was killed by a distracted driver. Maryland law passed in 2013 is named in his honor. When you're driving a car, you should be doing nothing other than that. But getting drivers to drop the phone hasn't worked as well as some would like. You're on your cell phone. You're, you're yeah. now allowed to be Actually, texting I, I or always, checking always, your messages. It's something that I, I, I just see every time. I drive from here to Annapolis. Howard County Delegate Frank Turner cites data showing in 2014, 38,000 drivers were cited for using phones behind the wheel. Last year, the number was 41,000. How much of that do you think has to do with an increased amount of cell phone use? That more people have cell phones and more people are using them in their cars? Well, that has a lot to do with it. Right now, first, second, and third offenses range between $75 and $175. His proposal gives judges the ability to impose fines up to $500. The numbers are not falling when you're constantly, over the last three years, giving out about 40,000 tickets a year. And we have so many alternative devices to use. Hands-free devices and radio GPS among them. Now, the two exceptions to the not holding your phone while you're driving rule are calling 911 and making hospital emergency calls, and those will remain the same. I'm Pat Warren reporting live. Now back to you, Denise. All right. Thank you very much, Pat. The bill was first introduced last session, but it did not get a hearing in the Senate.